som plastivač, plast po pocu pod lepe, lep solari in daj na prode. What's up everybody and welcome back to another dog friendly episode of Positive Vibes. We don't have too many of those, do we? No, we really don't. I'm your dog loving host, not Slim One. <laughs> Join with me this week is Gizmo. What's up, bud? Why is he, what's happening? I don't know, maybe that meal we gave him earlier really uh, satisfied his anger. Maybe the fat seeped into his brain. Yeah, <laughs> that could be it. He's having brain aneurysm right now. <laughs> just, we just don't know. Yeah. Also join with me this week on the show is Roach Bar. Nope. How's it going? <laughs> it's going. It's going. <laughs> okay, go back to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> also, we're joined with co host of the, with the Mo host, of course, the Iceman. What's up, bud? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> there okay. it is. Okay. <laughs> All right. No, you no, he's, stay. He's like, yeah, I'll still be your friend, you but uh, just don't touch him. Okay. <laughs> well, we're doing a single camera, no microphone, no technologically advanced, nothing on this. Doing no. a straight yeah. shot. Why? Because well, I, when this video releases, me and this fucking sleeping idiot are at the gathering of the Juggalos, and, you know, basically, I don't know, does it sound like complaining, or does it sound like smart? It sounds complaint. like smart, because, I mean, you've got, you got a lot to do before you leave. I've got to fucking edit. In the terms of only editing, I've got to edit the vlog, I've got to edit two, one challenge. Yeah, one challenge. One. Uh, I'm, we made another show for Ross that we'll get into in a couple of minutes. And the PV, so the vlog, the challenge, the PV, and and Ross's show. It's four shows. I gotta bang all that shit out on Sunday. You have to have that ready to release throughout the week. Yeah, so I have to edit everything, produce everything, upload everything. That's gonna take probably a solid, like a solid twelve hours. Yeah. With the upload speed that I have, it's so shit. Yeah, no kidding. So that's kind of like whatever. But. You know, I do what I want. This is kind of what I wanted to do. I mean, we didn't have any ability. I could edit tonight. You could start. So maybe. I don't know. I got some shit ha popping off tonight. You know, maybe you should even start tonight just because of uh, crashes. Yeah, that's a good call. You know, you make a good call, and I don't want to, like, say, oh, blah, blah, blah. However, um, all the multicam videos are like less than 15 minutes. Yeah. So I don't think that it's like, it's when they're really long. When we record the show and we have more than one camera, we're doing, you know, <coughs> I'm sure you've probably seen some clips if you watch the show when I've showed you delay placeholder videos because I can't release it. I play both 720p videos in one window with the video that is about to be rendered in another preview video window yeah so you got like three videos running at once it's pretty intensive on the processor i guess it would be especially at 720p i mean that's not complete high def but it's still pretty up there yeah and the computer is like fucking 20 years old yeah so 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 we make do that's right we but do make do let's just hope that you can get bang them all out and get them out there then yeah so i think yeah that's right i think that uh I probably shouldn't run into too many crashing problems, but who knows how that program's going to react running fucking yeah, editing videos for 12 hours. Yeah. Anyway, what's up, bud? Not a whole lot. Just trying to fucking soothe my, my burning lips right now. Yeah. And a challenge that comes out the week after the gathering, we cut up our faces and then rub citric acid into it. Yeah. So what make sure that, that you watch that. That's some interesting shit right there. Yeah. What's and, up with you? And then, uh, I don't know, man. Sorry that I'm a little bit out of it. Oh, here, okay. So, we're Saturday, yeah. the 16th. 16th. I got sick last Monday, like a week ago. Yeah. I woke up feeling like shit. And then on Tuesday, it progressed so bad. I, I was like, I knew that I was getting sick on Monday, so I went to the doctor Tuesday morning. And then on Tuesday night and Wednesday, forget it, man. I was fucked. <laughs> I was having, like, sensitive skin, sore muscles, hollow bones feeling, fucking hot flashes, cold sweats, oh, just coughing really up phlegm. That. When I get sick, bro, I get fucking sick, and I hate it. Yeah. Like, I get sick for, you know it. I know, I know, you become a fucking baby. It's, but, like, I'm sick <laughs> as fuck, though. Yeah, but you still, I know, you become a baby. <coughs> 
I'm sick right now, actually. Like, still, that's why we're talking about it. Yeah, fuck it, two days away from leaving for not even a whole two days, and you're still feeling like shit. I know. Well, I don't have that sensitive skin fucking yeah, that sore muscles bullshit. Now it's just, like, sinuses and lungs. But the thing about the lungs is, you know, it's no amazing feat, right? I'm not looking for any kudos here at all, okay? Uh, I haven't really, I did smoke some weed. I smoked, when I woke up on Monday, thought I was sick, I smoked a joint on Monday night, and then I didn't smoke again until Thursday night, and when I smoked on Thursday, it didn't even affect me, and now we're Saturday late afternoon, I haven't smoked weed, man, two joints, when I smoke dabs every fucking day, multiple times a day, and then I'm smoking a joint on Monday and a joint on Thursday, yeah. I didn't smoke this week. You know what I'm like, right? Okay? The gen good generalization. I, would say, yeah. I didn't fucking smoke this week, and I'm still fucking busted up. But I can tell that from not smoking, I'm better than I would be normally if I would have continued to smoke while being sick. So oh, there's yeah, def definitely would have been a lot worse. There's absolutely a benefit to not smoke. That's why we're, I'm not smoking on the show this week. Yeah. Yeah, nothing to burn on positive vibes. We got some weed, but... I don't... What's the do you want to smoke weed no, on the I'm show? No, okay. <laughs> Come on, man. Pick up the slack. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, man, I'm at the gathering of the Juggalos right now. Yes, you are. It's and Wednesday I'm, night. When this releases home. at 10 p.m. on Wednesday night, what is happening? It doesn't even matter. Fucking at, at around 10, 30... At 10 p.m. on Wednesday night? Oh, sorry. I was mistaking Wednesday for Thursday. I don't know, main stage will be popping off yeah. at, at that time. Right. So I'll be down at this time, right now, whatever, blah, 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 right? I'm at the main stage. Hey. Hey. <laughs> hey, do you know who's performing on the main stage on Wednesday night? Uh, Sess Crew at 6.30 and then Boondocks. Mm -hmm. And then who? Uh, is it Blaze? And then... Is uh, Tech the headliner? First night. He's the headliner on Wednesday night? Yeah. So it's like Tech 9, go back to sleep. There's like Tech 9's on the stage right now. That's what we're watching, Tech 9. Yeah. That's dope. You know Blunt and a Ho? Yeah. That's Tech. Right on. Right. So, so you'll be watching Tech 9, I'll be watching TV. Sweet. <laughs> should watch some Tech 9 videos. Yeah. Like, be there. Yeah, there we this. go. By 10 o'clock, I'll watch right. Tech 9 videos. That'll be cool. Or if you had some fucking real data and a phone, you could, like, live stream it on Facebook for me, you jerk. <laughs> yeah, right. I let my phone go into the fucking arrears a big time. Needless to say, my phone isn't turned on right now. And even if it was, bro, American data is so fucking yeah, much really money. Is. Kudo wants $75 for 75 gigs of American data. Wow. 75 gigs, though, that's a lot. When you're periscoping at the gathering, is yeah, it a lot? Maybe not. Right? So. Yeah, I don't know, bud. I'm just going to be sitting around here chilling. I won't even have the camper to chill in because you're fucking taking it with you. Hell yeah, it's going to be so What the sick. hell's up with that? You can't even leave me the camper. Fuck, I forgot that I have to clean out all this fucking carport bullshit. <laughs> now I have to edit and clean out the oh carport. Oh my god, yeah. Guess what? Shit. Carport's not getting cleaned. Probably not. <laughs> what about grass getting cut? Uh, probably not. <laughs> I didn't think so. I'll cut it when I come back. I don't think it's a problem. The one neighbor here, he, he was kind of, uh, he wasn't complaining, but he was kind of looking at the mess. He's like, you, you cleaning this mess up? Who, the young one? <laughs> yeah. Tell him to fuck off. <laughs> I hey? pretty much did. <laughs> <laughs> you know? No, funny. I'm not. He's so funny. Yeah. Oh, well. Can you hand me that fago, brother? I can do that. So... You know, I want to be, like, more ecstatic about being at the gathering and all that, but, you know, uh, how, how, I'm justifying a lot of shit today on the show. How fine is it that I do what I want and I'm sick and I don't need to be excited right now? I'm exhausted. Nothing wrong with that. There's you nothing. You heal, but I know. Thank you. Get too excited, you ain't gonna heal. I'm so pissed because... It's a lung thing, right? And there's no way that what I feel now is going to be gone by Wednesday night. No, you'll still be coughing it up. So it's like I can't be... But, okay, before I continue, blowing my nose. Like I'm still still one nostril breathing all week, but all the congestion is really clear. <coughs> <coughs> that was a...
was like a little tickle in my throat. <coughs> Excuse me. And all the shit I'm coughing up is not big, it's not green, it's very clear. Well, that's good. So, like, I'm on the tail end of it, but all this sinus shit is just oh, fucking with me. Pot. Keep doing that till you leave, take it with you, even. Yeah, I got one more neti pot treatment, I guess, that I'll save for tomorrow. And then I gotta go get some salt at the clinic before I leave. Oh, speaking of doctors, my fucking tooth shattered in my goddamn mouth. <laughs> like, Oh my god. Let, let's make it a little more dramatic, bud. For, of all the fucking things that could fucking go down before I go to the gathering, fucking get beat up by a gang of fucking dudes that just punched me in the face, tooth went flying right out of my mouth. Now I got a fucking, I got no fucking tooth in my fucking jaw. How's that? That's pretty good. I went to fucking eat a fucking chicken original <laughs> sandwich at, Mc, at Burger King today. Is that what did it? No, I don't know. I don't know. But when I walked out of Burger King, I went to the Walmart. And then I think it was walking out of Walmart that I realized I had, like, this sharp spot in my molar. I think I put it in the vlog because I took a shot of it with the camera. Did you? Yeah. <laughs> did you get a good shot? I think I might have. Good. I think I did. Because it's really hard to tell. It is. You can't, you know through those lenses, you can't point that in your mouth with sunlight <laughs> fucking shining that's on it and true, see yeah. that little hole. Little or not, it's still a big enough hole that's noticeable. It's sharp. It's sharp, yeah. It's sharp. So, my mouth, I got a little broken. Like, now you I'm sick. Maybe mouth. I'm whining. I don't fucking care right now. Well, I'm sick. sick as fuck. My tooth is fucking broken. Eh? Fuck, nothing's going your way. No, by. man, it's not. Got lots of water, though. We got lots of water. The camper's running flawlessly. Things are good. That air conditioning feels good. Fucking right on me. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's sweet. All of <laughs> I love it, too. Yeah. Look at this guy. He's fucking done. He is. Always sleeping, that fucker. Always sleeping. I think he fell out of the frame. Nope, I can still see him there. So, I don't know. Uh, we'll keep going, obviously. It's only been a couple of minutes. What's up with you, man? Talk a little bit. Oh, well, what the hell do you want me to talk about? My kid, she's gone for the weekend. I've got a weekend to myself. Well, I mean, today's Saturday night, so that's pretty much the weekend gone. But she left yesterday for a grand bend with her friends. So they're up there partying. 17-year-old girls, a bunch of them partying in a cabin. Uh, so she's getting killed this weekend? <laughs> pretty much, right? <laughs> <laughs> fucking horror movie She's in the making. She's just going to dress in some lingerie and get murdered. <laughs> that's what's happening right that now. That sucks. Maybe that's why I haven't heard from her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, we laugh now. I hope yeah. it's not real. Yeah, no, actually, <laughs> one of her friend's parents uh, went up and they got their own cabin so that they can be up there, too. Okay. But, but these girls, there's like seven of them in one cabin. Just partying it out. What about you? Have you made any plans for next week while I'm gone? Just working? Oh, you know my plans, but I work and I go home, that's it. Fuck, maybe I'll do some yard work. You got a lot of mulch in Walk your yard still. It looks like you have new mulch I in do. Yard. The fucking assholes came up. <laughs> they, they He's like, I got all this mulch, I gotta get rid of it. <laughs> what happened? They, they came up, because there's a stump there, right? So they came along <coughs> and they fucking grinded up the whole stump. The one at my house and one down the street. And they left the fucking pile of mulch there. Both houses. You guys don't clean up their fucking messes. Oh, I saw that mulch at, on the corner. On the corner? No, it's well, it's, it's between my driveway and the other driveway. Oh, yeah, down the road. Yep, that one too. Yeah? Yep. I thought that was your mulch. I'm Did like, oh, really? good, he got rid of some. <laughs> that's, what I, that's what I thought when I saw that. That was another stump that they found out. <laughs> no, <coughs> didn't get rid of the <coughs> shit. And, and the bastards, that tree that they cut down there, uh, one of the limbs a week before, and this is the reason they cut it down, because it, the limbs were falling off. Uh, one of the limbs came off and took out my neighbor's wire, hydro wire going to his home, which ended up costing him $800 for them to put up a new conduit for hydro one to come in and run the wire through and hook it back up to the meter. Then he gets his hydro bill and that's $250 more because hydro one decided to fucking charge him to hook the wire back up. But the tree isn't even his, it belongs to the town. It's fucking bullshit. Did he pay it? Nope, he called them up. He said, I'm not paying. He said, you guys can go to the town and get that money because I'm not paying for that. It wasn't my fucking tree that fell on that wire. Cool. But he was out the 800 to have the conduit put back onto his house. Fucking 800 bucks for that. That's insane. Yeah. I would have done it for 300. 
Like Ricky in the Trailer Park Boys? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Stealing power is easy. I can't yeah, remember could... any two Trailer Park Boys quotes. I'm too fucked. Yeah, me either. I didn't, I didn't watch a whole lot of it. I've watched some, but not a whole lot of Trailer Park Boys. I've watched every episode of that show. Yeah. You watched the last season too? Yeah. I, I haven't seen it yet. The new stuff's different than the old shit, but what isn't when you revive something? Hey, remember in uh, Fuller House? You watched all I of did. it. I did, yep. How come when Stephanie was at the vet where DJ works with yep. the boys and then they got sprayed by the skunk? Yep. How did she get two big vats of fucking tomato juice into the fucking back <laughs> room? TV magic, bud. Camera magic. It's like, why wouldn't she just <laughs> Yeah, go, just out of the blue, right? <laughs> just two giant fucking body-sized yep. vats of tomato juice. That was pretty good. Their naked boobs in it. Oh, I love to see her naked boobs. I know. You can on, did, like, Did some... you ever imagine when we were kids that she would grow up to look like that? No, I never thought about her fucking growing up. No. I never thought about it, what she, what she would be like growing up. But now, I'm cool now, with it. yeah. Me too. Very cool with Even Stephanie DJ. Tanner. DJ's not bad. They're all super Kimmy, hot. Well, Kimmy's kind of hot. They're all super hot. That all face kind of bothers me. No, she's hot. She's like, she's quirky and fun. Yeah. She's like, she'll she, fucking... She'd be the one that's wild in bed. Yeah, she's the type of girl that will, like, make you wear a condom to fuck her. Yeah. But then she'll peel the condom off and... <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's who Gibbler that's the kind is. That's girl yeah, she oh, is, yeah. yeah. She's a good You're girl. Right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I got all these things that have been rushing through my mind to fucking say, so I'll say them. Candy Apple Fago, now for sale in Canada. How fucking dope is that? Did you know that? No, I didn't realize Yeah, we that. just picked up a bunch of fucking... We picked up, like, six or eight cases of Fago Holy today. Holy shit. And now they're selling candy apple in oh, you didn't Canada. Get, okay, you didn't get just candy apple though. We got all kinds. Let me tell them to you. We got, we got a couple of candy apples. We got a cotton candy, a twist because Jeff wanted to, some to mix drinks. We got a, a grape. Yeah. We didn't get a red pop. I've never I tried the grape. I should have grabbed a case of I've, red pop. I've never. Oh, you should have. Yeah. Fago grape is like the best grape. I've soda. never been a, a grape fan for anything really. Okay. I don't mind grape jelly, it's but I can only eat so much of it. Grape juice, maybe one cup, and I'm good for months. Like Welch's but grape, grape juice? Grape pop, I have never enjoyed any grape pop. Well, I'll fucking give you a two yeah, liter before we leave. Uh, the, the cotton candy, I don't like that one very much. Uh, you know, I had it a, a while ago, and I'm like, this is just sugar water. Yeah, this is my favorite. Right I here, love definitely. candy apple flavor. That one this is, is my favorite uh, what too. was that other one you had me get hooked on? 60-40, like Pine Fresca? Apple... Pineapple, pineapple orange, pineapple, pineapple watermelon. Pineapple banana? No, orange or watermelon. Okay, well it wasn't orange, so it must have been watermelon. That was a good one too, I like that one. There's a few like rare flavors that are hard to come by. They used to make awesome flavors like uh, um, diet key lime pie. Do they ever come up with limited time flavors? I don't know. Yeah, uh, around Christmas time they released some uh, St. Nichols Cola or some shit. I can't remember. I think it might just be cola with like a fucking Christmas. Yeah. Well, I've always wondered when, when pops do stuff like that, bring out a limited time drink, if maybe they really fucked up one of the uh, recipes, like a big big batch of it, and they're like, okay, well, let's just slap this name on it and call it a limited time drink. <laughs> I've always well, I'm thought not. about... I'm sure they go through like I always R&D thought about that stuff. with Crystal Pepsi the first time it came out. Uh, no, I don't know. I think some guys are on coke and they're like, clear. <laughs> it's all clear to me man. now. Yeah, man. Yeah. <laughs> I forget the other things that I wanted to say, but that's well, okay. Well, you oh. fucking shot a uh, Juggalos Review Foods today. Hell yeah, we, we did shoot Juggalos Review for Foods. That. Well, I was the most painted, I guess. I guess a couple other guys had a lot of paint, too. I definitely skimped on the paint. Both but once again, did. justified because I'm fucking sick. I just didn't feel like sweating in it and being a fucking piece of shit. More like he didn't want to shave. He was supposed to shave. I put, look, do you up. see makeup in a my beard? A little bit, yeah. Because I don't have a problem putting makeup in my beard. I'm going to shave before I go to the gathering, oh, yeah. that's for sure, yeah. Yeah, um, I got to fucking get some soap and water on my face. I still got some caked on here and there. Oh, yeah, it's all over your cheeks and Is shit, it? yeah. Fuck. Fuck. <coughs> but yeah, we shot a Juggalos Review food, so make sure that if you're not subscribed to Ross's channel, you go to Ross TV Comedy and subscribe to it, because we made another one, 
and it's gonna drop. And knowing Ross, he's gonna fucking drop it right away. Like, why would he sit on it? Yeah, probably the right? week after the because it's gonna be already edited. Yeah. So this drops while we're at the gathering, so I don't mind spoiling it now because I'm gifting the fucking show to Ross. He has no idea. No, it's gonna be a surprise Tuesday when he shows up. Or is yeah. it on Monday? I'm giving him I I don't know Tuesday okay. I think. I'm gonna give him a coffee crisp chocolate bar and a fucking thumb drive with an episode of the show on it. Perfect. I love you, Ross, eh? Yeah, that's right, Good to bud. see you again, bud. Wish I could make it this year and see you. And yeah, so we're at the gathering, so he's not watching this right now. Yeah, he, he doesn't know. know. So how fucking cool are we, eh? We're fucking awesome, bud. Thanks, Roach Bomb, for fucking letting us use his makeup yep. and shit. Got all painted up again. So that was good. That was very good, and the fucking meal was good. Yeah, I love it, man. Oh, God, I love their gyros. <clears throat> I'm just thinking about the gathering, bro. I want to be there, and I'm bummed again if I don't... Sorry for being redundant, but I'm really bummed that I'm going to feel ill. Like, it's inevitable. Yeah. It's inevitable. I'm fucked for the gathering. Well, so, like, instead maybe of... Totally. Maybe, maybe I mean, not. You're, you're on the downswing now, so it's going to just get better day by day. That's true. But once again, I do fucking... Of course, then you're going to come back with the Juggalo flu. Yeah, I'm going to catch... I'm already... My immune system's already down. I'm going to catch the plague for sure. Yeah. For sure. <laughs> right? I'm done. And then what... You're not coming back and then immediately going to Grand Bend. That'll be the next weekend, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's right. I'll okay. come back on Sunday and then I do four midnight shifts and okay. then I'm going to go to Grand Bend for fucking... Three days. Yeah, three nights. Three days. My right. brother's gonna be there. Is he? He told me he's going up there. Sweet. Yeah, that is pretty sweet. So I got a lot fucking popping off, man. I got a lot finally popping off. I get to do the gathering. I get to pull the camper to Grand Bend again. Uh, not again, but I get to pull the camper again. This time to Grand Bend. Yeah. I've owned the camper for two years, and what have I done with it? I've partied a lot in it, yeah. and I've pulled it to the gathering twice, twice. thrice. So this will be the third and fourth time that you've actually used it for legitimate use. That's right. Outside of your driveway. That's right. Does it diminish its legitimateness, legitimacy, um, legitimate, what is the word? Legitimacy? Yeah, legitimacy, I think so. Yeah, that sounds right. And yeah, I think it, it kind of does. I mean... You we, can't just party in your camper in the <laughs> driveway, it's not the same? Because, yeah, I mean, you're not really camping out, you're not really going anywhere. What we're doing in here, we could be doing inside. Yeah. 20 feet away. But we're in the camp. But we're in the camper, which is cool. It is cool. I love it so much. Yeah. I almost bought myself a pop-up a few years ago just so I could have one in the driveway to party up once in a while. Hell yeah, man. They're the shit. It's like a free, it's like a cheap extension of your house. Pretty much. <coughs> Except the pop-up <coughs> an air conditioner. What is my house? We're shooting all the fucking positive vibes in here. Oh, your house is so fucking Oh, my house is done. Place. My house is literally fucking hoarders oh, right now. Yeah, it's bad. It's horrible. It's, like, embarrassingly horrible. Yeah, it's, it's so bad. bad. <laughs> I gotta fucking do something about it. Yeah. So. Well, you did. You invited someone over. Yeah. Yeah, I get some help. Oh, my God. I'm so fucking congested. Let me see how long this is. 23, 24 minutes. So we'll go for another minute or two. That sounds fun. Oh, is someone waking up? No, he's out. <laughs> that would have been perfect. Come, Roman, stay go! <coughs> oh, fuck, see? Like, that's the type of shit I'm dealing with. And I'm supposed to smoke next weeks, week? Though. I'm supposed to smoke next week? Yeah. I can't do that. Like, it's just gonna. I, I'm going there to get hot. You're not <laughs> supposed to smoke. I mean, that's just something you do. <laughs> but you're gonna be getting high on other substances, so smoking is really. The do you least think of it. taking shrooms and LSD with bad lungs is a. Like, it doesn't affect your lungs. No. I just don't want it to fucking cause me a bad trip. Which essentially turns into a good trip, because when you're done a bad trip, you're like, wow, that was fucking awesome. Right? I guess, I, I don't know, I'm just saying, I don't want to fucking take acid and then have energy and jump into a crowd and then my lungs die and then I'm buckled over coughing like I just was until I can't breathe anymore. <laughs> Which even when I'm not on acid happens yeah. when I get sick. 
but that happens when I'm smoking when I'm sick and I haven't been fucking smoking. Very true. Which is really, I mean, I can't believe you had this many days. We smoked two joints since Monday. Yeah. That's pretty good. And everybody's getting high over here. Yeah. Everybody's getting right high. In front of you. Everybody's ripping dabs. It's not like a, I'm like, yeah, no, I can't. I'm not yeah. going to make nobody, obviously. So. Uh, oh, that gyro is fucking coming back on me. I love it. Your dog's about the size of a two liter. Let me see. <laughs> Look how scared he gets. <laughs> Call him up. Come on. Let's, let's see. Get up here. Come here. I'm going to make a dog out of a two liter and an apple. Does he? Can, we, <laughs> and an apple. can we do a side by side comparison? Pretty close. I'm pretty close. The body, anyways. <laughs> what are you going to use for his legs? You got his head in his body. Why is it, he's terrified of a bottle? He's terrified of everything, bud. Everything. You saw me drop a rolling paper on him last night. Yeah, <laughs> Iceman <laughs> dropped a rolling paper on the dog last night. He got so fucking scared. Fucking jumped right up. Pussy ass dog. He's terrified that I'm petting him. Lay down. Anyway, you know what? We should probably just fucking call it quits based on that shit that I said about editing and processing. Yeah, because yeah. you really should get to some shit. Yeah. So that's it, man. I'm at the gathering of the fucking Juggalos right now, and I'm sure that if my lungs aren't fucking bust and I feel shithouse because of it, I'm having an amazing time. I'm not getting stuck in the mud this year. I'm definitely not doing that. You know, I get to see Ross. You're going to stay out of that lot this time? Yeah, I'm Third not going year, you're not going to go back into that no, lot? No, I learned yeah. my lesson the first two times. All right. So <laughs> I'm going to be on the lot with Ross and fucking Carney King and... Well, that's the other thing. Is he staying on the lot or is he taking the... Uh, <coughs> Ross is staying in the camper. Oh, is he? Okay. Yeah. Right on. I thought he was yeah. getting a hotel. Oh, I told Pickle he could fat ass bailed on the gathering. What about Rob and Cass? Are they getting a hotel still? No, they decided that they're going to stay on the uh, lot too. Oh, right on. Awesome. Yeah, that's so I told sweet. everybody just to get like a 30 to 50 foot extension cord. Yeah. Then they could be... Uh, Electrified. Yeah, we just need to space them out properly from the camper and each other. But there's going to be a lot of fucking Pokemon at the gathering. Listen, I'm not fucking talking about Pokemon on the show. You just okay? did. No, I'm saying that I'm not talking about <laughs> it. There's a lot of fucking shit in Juggalo groups about it. Yeah, I bet, I bet about them, them wanting to do it. Well, and, yeah, fuck. There's going to be, you're going to be seeing people on fucking acid and shrooms staring at their phones catching Pokemon. Not me. Well, that's because you can't. No, because I don't, I wouldn't. <laughs> you keep saying that, but you just can't. So there's no reason to even say anything else. No, I could fucking do it around my house right here with my Wi-Fi. Yeah, I guess you probably could, but there's no Pokemon around your house. Anyway, <laughs> thank you. I was going to try and keep it going. <laughs> thank you very much for being on the show, Iceman. Yeah, no problem. Bro. Thanks always for always helping me get all this good. shit together for the gathering. You're the welcome. gathering of the Juggalos. Got your step you know? fixed. No broken ankles at the gathering. Yeah, we got a little bit of August fucking gathering related videos planned to yeah. release. A whole month of a gathering, why would you do that? That's going to be awesome. Yeah, that's going to be easier for us here to fucking get caught up on some shit. Yeah. And, uh, and, and that's good. Right? That's very good. I like it. I like that kind. So, that's it then. I'm at the gathering. I'm having fun. Iceman's fucking watching Tech 9 videos. Yeah. Roachbong's probably sleeping. Probably. I'm not even going to wake him up. He's really tired. i got to let him get some rest. So then, then that's it for real. Thanks for watching this episode of uh, Positive Vibes. Hold on. Fuck. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. Thank you for watching this episode of Positive Vibes. I am your host, Not Slim One. Kicking it at the fucking gathering. Hardcore big time right now. And join with me this week on the show was Roach Bong and the Iceman. Thank you for being on the show, bud. Uh, Hands. Peace. Gizmo's on the show too, yeah. Come on. Say goodbye. Hey. Here. Woo! -hoo! Oh my god, it's the year of the fucking butthole, baby. <laughs> Woo! Alright, that's it. Stay tuned for an all new episode of the show next Wednesday after 10 p.m. like we do. And that's it. So until that time, peace. <laughs>